Does this look familiar to you? Does it drive you nuts like it does to me? We all love our dogs, but dealing with this hair is such a nuisance, isn't it? I have a Saint Bernard, and I know as well as anyone what it's like trying to keep hair off the carpets, furniture, bed sheets, stairs. It's insane, especially in the fall. So I saw this new thingamajig called an Uproot Cleaner. It had crazy good reviews, and everyone was saying how it would remove dog hair that was left behind by the vacuum that you didn't even know was there. So I got my hands on one so I can put it to the test for myself. Although this is an AI generated voice. It's me in the video. It's just easier for me this way. The packaging was great. Communication with the company was great. Shipping was great, even with the Christmas rush. So far so good, but we haven't tried it yet. Inside the box, I have a long rake to drag across the floors and a mini version for small areas and steps. Let's see about the height. So, I vacuum vigorously every single day. I'm obsessed with not having dog hair everywhere. We love our gentle giant, but his hair can be an issue if left alone. I don't want it on our furniture or clothes or in our coffee mugs, or more importantly, on our guests. It's a challenge to say the least. Up to this point, I was pretty confident that my house was hair free after I vacuumed. Out of sight, out of mind, I guess. I purposely didn't vacuum under my couch for a few days because I knew I'd be putting this to the test and I'd have plenty to work with. Seeing is believing, right? Here it is, unscripted and tested out of the box. And it looks like all the positive reviews were real. I'm sold. It works better than a vacuum. The little teeth really dig in deep. And if there is a better way to remove hair than this, please let me know. If you have the same problems I do, this is a no brainer. If you need a gift for someone that has this problem, again, it's a no brainer. Check the description and use my link for an instant discount at any time.